The 2018 International Fleet Review is now on. The host nation's Navy organized a number of programs through Sunday. The main event, which showcases dozens of warships from 12 different countries, is on tomorrow. Kan Yong-woo files us this report from Jeju. With several maritime patrol aircraft and helicopters leading the way, more than a dozen warships in a line formation sail towards the flagship. The South Korean Navy held a final rehearsal before the main event of this year's International Fleet Review, which is set to take place on Thursday off the southern coast of Jeju-do Island. After the warships and submarines pass by the flagship, the South Korean Navy's underwater demolition team showed off their maritime infiltration skills by jumping from an aircraft at a high altitude into the operation area in the sea. As the main driving force of the nation's maritime power, the South Korean Navy will support peace and prosperity on the Korean Peninsula and keep sailing until our country becomes one of the world's strongest maritime powers. Taking place for the third time in South Korea, the 2018 International Fleet Review features the largest number of participating foreign naval forces, with representatives from 46 countries coming to Jeju-do Island. Most of the events are open to the public at the Jeju Civilian Military Complex port through Sunday. As well as showing the South Korean Navy's firepower, this year's International Fleet Review will highlight the nation's strong ties with its allies. Kan Yong-woo, Arirang News, Jeju.